Dr. Vijay Bang. I am Senior International Cardiologist at Lilavati Hospital. I am working here last 25 to 26 years. I am specialized in coronary angiography, angioplasty, pacemakers. There are two major problems in the society as far as cardiac problems are going on. The major problem comes from high-risk individuals who have diabetes, hypertension, obesity, and high cholesterol. These are the patients smoking. These are the patients get maximally affected. Two conditions patients can die. One is cardiac arrest. Cardiac arrest is the electrical problem of the heart where the electrical system of the heart fails and patient develops cardiac arrest. Before having a cardiac arrest, three to five minutes, heart beats at very high rate of three to 500. If, if it is detected and a patient is intervened at that time, life can be saved. What, whose, which equipment will save the life? That is a defibrillator in the society which is available on the road because this requires immediate treatment within three to five minutes. If nothing is done, a patient is unlikely to survive. And this is uh, the current incidence in India is of about 10% of all deaths is due to sudden cardiac arrest. And if you go to see total 12 lakh people die in India due to sudden cardiac arrest. This is a major, major societal problem and it, it loses the life in a productive age in a younger age group. So this is very important aspect one. Second is heart attack. Heart attack occurs from the blockage of the artery suddenly due to uh, blood clotting in the main artery which supplies the blood to the heart. So if these arteries are closed then you need to get severe chest pain which is not controllable. You need to rush to the casualty of any big hospital or if big hospital is not available go to at least nursing home, get yourself ECG done, proper diagnosis and thrombolysis or if you have a cath lab capable center get the angioplasty, primary angioplasty done. Primary angioplasty is the choice of the treatment standard of care in the world. So you should get it done that immediately. So without any hesitation once you have a heart attack or else at least thrombolysis should be given followed by angiography angioplasty. These are the two approaches. One is the PAMI and second is the pharmacoinvasive approach which I have both explained to you in a short time. And coming back to cardiac arrest, cardiac arrest is well known to be controlled only by one particular equipment which is installed in the body a small one it is of two finger to three finger size and it can deliver a shock detect the arrhythmia and it can deliver a shock but it has to be selected in a patient who are the potential patient who can have a cardiac arrest whose pumping of the heart has come down to less than 30 percent those are the patient likely to have a cardiac arrest and they benefit from this icd we call it implantable convertible device which detects the arrhythmia and gives shock and converts and saves the life so this is very two important aspect on the world heart day one is the heart attack and second is a cardiac arrest which i briefly explained to you if any issue regarding this you can contact me at lilavati hospital Thank you very much.